is going on in Dalton is a disgrace and is spilling over into the 17 communities making up Thornton Township. Here's the thing, everybody can't be wrong. You, know, you can't have all these people saying what they say. We'd like to see the township do better as well, and we want to encourage that. Now, Marcos Mayor is calling for other municipalities to speak out against Tiffany Hanyard, who is the supervisor as well. So I've, I've looked at that question, whether the state uh, should uh, and can play a role. Um, the federal authorities, as you may know, are involved and in, in investigating. I, I've read that. I think that's a public um, piece of information. Uh, there is an investigation that's been called for, and now I know there was a veto that was overridden that will now allow that investigation to go forward with former Mayor Lori Lightfoot in charge of that. Um, I think that those are two pretty good authorities for looking into this, investigating it, and getting to the truth. And the state probably will support them. Well, we again, we, we looked at whether we ought to put resources, whether it's state police and their anti-corruption efforts, or asking the attorney general. The is that we already, there are already two pretty significant investigations going on, and so we'll support them in every way that we can, uh, but it's really just a matter of do you want everybody running over each other in those investigations, or do you want you know, a two concerted efforts toward getting the fact? When people ask you what happened here, tell them the North remembers. Tell them winter came. <laughs> and I know other YouTubers are like going to tear this up all day tomorrow in the next day in the next day <laughs> no you have no idea what happened you have no idea what is currently happening you're skipping around in a field full of bombs and mistaking them for daisies mm, let me know what you think in the comments how much longer she got eight days uh, six days. Let me know in the comments. How much longer she got? Let me tell you what just happened. That was the mayor of one of the townships that she's supervising. Then, the governor came out next. Did you hear the part where he said the state police? Did you hear the part where he said we're trying to see if we need resources? Tiffany, they're looking at you like a tyrant. I took your little plan and I turned it on itself. Look what I did to this city with a few drums of gas and a couple of bullets. Hmm? You know it is over. Like, who's in your ear, girl? Who is telling you anything? Like, I don't know. We as the public have been telling you from as far away as, like, I see people from other countries watching this saying, is she crazy, right? You see the comments all over social media and you're not thinking about that? Okay, um, as I hear, we have an investigation going on by the, <laughs> yeah, at this time over the village. Is that what's going on right now? Yeah. Okay, you are going to have quiet, quiet. Everybody listen to y'all. Quiet. So we got an uh, investigation over the village as a whole of all the employees. Or just elected officials? Uh, whatever they put in the subpoena. Just, just, just trying to get some clarity on this here. <laughs> All right. All right. Nobody's been in your ear telling you, girl, you're going to jail. Girl, you're, you, you, you're. And then when you use religion, oh, God, God, just keep praying to God. What God are you praying to, Tiffany? What God are you praying to? It's clearly not the one everybody else prays to. Is it Satan? <laughs> like, I, I don't understand. It's Tiffany, the governor just made a statement. He's telling you Lori Lightfoot and the FBI.
We support both of those investigations. That is your governor. <laughs> no, you have no idea what happened. You have no idea what is currently happening. You're skipping around in a field full of bombs and mistaking them for daisies. If you're higher than your governor in that state, then I don't know what to do. He even put pressure on, he mentioned the attorney general. We're going to see if we uh, have to reach out to the attorney general. So all your little friends that you thought were protecting you, they're in trouble now. They're throwing shots across the bow, letting it be known to the attorney general Who's probably your friend. It's looking a little light up there with all the department heads is that little financial lady she even ran. The state's uh, highest attorney, right? They were also throwing a shot against the bow to everybody else who's playing nice with you. Your reign is over. H have you talked to your baby's father in the last 48 hours have you talked to him at all <laughs> you, you know your daughter's baby's father you know the guy that's married to the newscaster <laughs> have you talked to him have you made preparations like I, 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 I don't understand that's why everybody's been so enthralled. Oh, I'm clickbait. I'm clickbait. Y'all owe me money. What was the lady's name? She said she going to spend a dollar on each of y'all's books when y'all go to jail. She going to send a dollar. I believe her. I believe her name is Valerie, uh, Valerie Stubbs. She said, I'm going to send a dollar to each of y'all. She even told you what the menu in the Fed pen is going to be. You don't see all these signs of history from all the people that are your elders that kept screaming from the top of their lungs. Y'all are going to jail. Mister, don't pray for me no more. He going to, bro. Keith Freeman, he going to make his deal. Well, I didn't have a choice. And now neither do you. How is they that even come to now? us? We can go to the FBI right now. And you can ask for the same deal that I got. They won't give us that deal. They will. Or they want you to trick us into believing that so that we confess. They... Oh, my goodness. What's the name of the guy that uh, did what he did to the survivor? Andrew Holmes. Andrew's already been making his deals. Now, I don't know if Andrew's deal is going to get him out of what he did in Las Vegas to that woman, I, I just don't know. Because it would have to be between a Las Vegas prosecutor and a Illinois prosecutor. Because the Illinois prosecutor might say, he's a witness for us. Can you help him out? But you still got a victim to deal with that ain't going for it. I don't care how many ambulances he's chased. Doesn't matter. So again, Tiffany. I, I don't know what to say. Except I, I see your downfall now. Like I really see it. That was the governor. He's, he's the top in that whole state. Right? And then you have one mayor that's coming for you. All the rest of them are about to start. Making their statements. You, you know, all those mayors in the township that you supposedly are the boss of. <laughs> yeah, girl, you don't have a clue. Like, where was your education? Where was your parents? Oh, my God. Like, oh, that's why we all watch this in horror. You have been a train wreck. But now we're about to see the train finally crash. Like, the gas is gone. I've seen this play over and over and over again, Tiffany. The mayors are going to come out like drip, 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 one by one. Talking shit. She don't stand for us. 
we need a change in leadership at that township or we just don't need a township. You think those people are going to let you run the township into the ground? Keith sees it. He's a little older than you, right? He sees it. He's already making a plea bargain for a couple years. They are going to make an example out of you that is going to be historic. The last example they made was Kilpatrick. I can't say the example they're going to make about you. Kilpatrick got 28 years. But, you know, keep on being Tiffany. You had to come out and make a statement against Lori Lightfoot. You idiot. Now you see the pull that that lady has. The governor has came out and said, oh, we're respecting the FBI and Lori Lightfoot. I did. I have not to <laughs> cooperate with Lori Lightfoot because uh, I'm saying her name on national television. I don't care who likes her, who hates her. If she says she's going to investigate we respect what she says, and we're going to let those investigations continue. They're throwing shots against... Girl, you just don't even see the writing on the wall. You had to come out because you didn't want to let her speak. You had to go against that Lori Lightfoot lady. Judge Nancy Edmonds said she could have given Kwame Kilpatrick a life sentence for his sweeping corruption Tiffany. in public office. Tiffany. But instead, she limited his sentence to nearly three decades. You don't remember him? Convictions on racketeering, bribery, extortion, mail and wire fraud, and tax crime. As you call her, Beetlejuice. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Everybody in the Chicago knows. Your reign is over. I know this is hard for you, but winter is coming. We know what's coming with it. We can't face it alone. The gates have been breached. They're, they're cold and cold. Our men will fight harder than cell swords ever could. They will defend their queen to the last man. Yes, Your Grace. The Red Keep has never fallen. It won't fall today. Monitoring what's going on in Dalton and Thornton Township and leadership there. Are you concerned? Taxpayers seem very worried. There's chaos at meetings. What can be done? Could you play a role in stepping in some way? What, what are, what's your take on the situation? So I've, I've looked at that question whether the state uh, should uh, and can play a role. Um, the federal authorities, as you may know, are involved and in, in investigating. I, I've read that. I think that's a public um, piece of information. Uh, there is an investigation that's been called for and now. I know there was a veto that was overridden that will now allow that investigation to go forward with former Mayor Lori Lightfoot in charge of that. Um, I think that those are two pretty good authorities for looking into this, investigating it, and getting to the truth. And the state We'll support them. Well, we again, we, we looked at whether we ought to put resources, whether it's state police and their anti-corruption efforts, or asking the attorney general. The reality is that we already there are already two pretty significant investigations going on, and so we'll support them in every way that we can. Uh, but it's really just a matter of do you want everybody running over each other in those investigations, or do you? What's going on in Dalton? is a disgrace and is spilling over into the 17 communities making up Thornton Township. Here's the thing, everybody can't be wrong. You, know, you can't have all these people saying what they say. We'd like to see the township do better as well, and we want to encourage that. Now, Marcos Mayor is calling for other municipalities to speak out against Tiffany Hanyard, who is the supervisor as well.